Hello everyone, welcome to the open house for geometry. This is a geometry Zoom room with all the teachers here for you. I'm Miss Reese. All right, and we're going to talk about the some of the fall highlights. Um, Mr. Rice mentioned earlier that we've been using Desmos to track student work in real time um, and also give students the ability to check their own work. So we'll give you a little class demo here. I'm going to be the teacher and I have my uh, students here. And here is what I can see. Um, so what I'm looking at here and what you can see is as a teacher, I can see all the slides that we're working on for the day, and I can see which slide each of my students is on. So something I might wanna do is put all of my students at a specific slide. I wanna uh, focus their attention on something. So right now I'm gonna focus everyone's attention onto slide two. I wanna go over this slide. So I'm gonna show you what this looks like from a student view. So what I might be asking students to do in this slide is use the sketch pad to figure out and mark um, other additional items that would be congruent in these triangles. So I would say, okay, well, this side in both triangles is the same exact side. I'm gonna add a little mark here to show that that side is congruent. And then I'm gonna try um, saying, okay, well, why do I think these triangles are congruent? Well, I might say angle side angle. Uh, and then I can see, oh, I did not get it right. I attempted it once though. And then I might say, okay, well, it's actually angle angle side. And then I would go ahead and submit an explanation for that. So that's on the student end. Um, as a teacher, I can then look and see through my summary here, I can see, okay, um, Mr. Sipple's done this, Mr. Rice has done this, Mr. Flores. Um, now I might need to check in on Ms. Wong. I can see that she hasn't made progress on this slide. Or I can look at Mr. Sipple's slide and I can see, okay, great. He placed a congruent mark here. Um, he did try this problem twice just to just to see how many times students tried some of the problems. And then I can see um, what his reasoning is for each of these. So Desmos is something that we've used extensively this year um, in order to check student progress. And they've made great strides in um, their distance learning offerings.
Thank you everyone for coming to see, see us on Open House and Zoom. Um, and if you'd like to contact any of us, our, our information is here and we'd be happy to hear from you.